I'm on my way to Belfast to meet Stephen Ray, one of our most distinguished actors. Stephen has traveled the globe and has performed on many of the world's great stages. I love the fact that he's always been proud of his Belfast origins and his gorgeous accent. Stephen has enjoyed the company of many of the world's leading writers, as well as Ireland's best. What I find fascinating about him is his belief that a love of your own place and a curiosity about the wider world are both as important as each other. Bring down your sweet child, Lord, and let me ride. If you make it to heaven, before I do, save a seat on me. Saving a seat for us. That's a lovely Melbourne May, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> the much of Belfast is in your, or has contributed to oh, your yes. art. What I always wanted to avoid was being a parody of Belfast. You know what I mean? I didn't want, I, I, I wanted to maintain my way of speech because it was fundamental to me. My, my favorite thing in the world, really, is, and it was when I was at school, is reading aloud, you know. I used to, you know, everybody else was terrified of reading aloud, but I just loved it when it came, you know, when the teacher said, now, Ray, will you read that, you know, and I just, I loved it. That's where your acting came from. To be in demand uh, as an actor, as an artist, by, by Beckett and Brian Freeland, um, yeah, and Sam Shepard. Sam Shepard and, yeah, and, um, and, and Frank McGuinness and, and um, Harold Pinter. Seamus Heaney. Seamus Heaney, yeah, I mean, that's, yeah. You don't. Uh, I know. You know. And do you think and, it's... And the great Derek Mahan as well, you know. Uh, oh, he, geez, he did yeah. v versions of, uh, of French plays that I was in. Um, we're just... We're incredibly fortunate uh, to have such wonderful writers in this country. Talk to me about Derek Martin. He was a pal of yours, wasn't he? Uh, yeah, and I love his, his writing, and there's a, an element of uh, serious suffering in Derek, you know? Life was very difficult for him. But he doesn't belabor you with the pain, you know what I mean? He really doesn't. It's, 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 it's actually the most rhythmic poetry you can imagine. Beautiful. And, and, and he's a huge um, a classical scholar, you know, and... Uh, as was Heaney, and they they bring to their even their colloquial poetry here. They bring that classical sense. When you read great writing, every word teaches you. You know what I mean. 